Yeah, they're doing good. They're doing a good job. We're, we're, we're putting a lot of pressure on them. We're trying to put as much game day pressure on them as we possibly can. Mark, Mark D'Antonio said Catholic is your number one long He is right now, huh? And he's doing a good job. Both those guys are doing a good job. What have you seen out of Donnie? Is there anything with him maybe having a little bit of a bigger role in offense this year? you want to get other guys working? Well, we just need some depth. I mean, yeah. you know, we, we want to become explosive in our return games and not just secure the ball and get it back to our offense. And we want to create some field position for our offense. So that's been the main uh, focus this camp. What have you seen out of Donnie Corley in the return game? Um, a freshman. He's still a freshman. You know, very talented, but still a freshman. How would you describe kind of the personality of your linebackers? We see them out there running and screaming. Uh -huh. It seems like they got a lot of energy. They do. They there. have a lot of enthusiasm, a lot of feels um, every day. Um, got a great group. Um, you know, we talk about hitting that wall. When there is no wall, we're going to climb over the wall. And, uh, you know, we talk every day about being tough and violent. And so far, so good. Chris and John, after getting a lot of experience uh -huh. last year, where have you seen them grow from a year ago? And where do they need to keep? Well, they they got you know tackling in space is, is an issue right now that we're concentrating on. Uh, but I see the growth in their knowledge of our defense. I mean, it's growing tremendously. You know, all the little nuances, checks, those kind of things. The confidence level is really really good right now. They're performing at a very high rate. Well, oh. then coming back, how do you? you see a rotation? Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. How do you work that? we got to work him back in slowly. And again, my job is to get him confident in his knee. And then we'll worry about that rotation after that happens. Until that happens, there is no rotation. He's going to get his reps, and you know, we're going to try to bring him along slowly and, and get confidence in that thing. So you might, you might be a few games into the season. We'll see. I have no really idea. We'll yeah. see. i got no earthly idea. Is Bryce uh, still working at the morning? He is. Yep, he sure is. And I'm rolling John over there, too. Now Andrew Dow comes at the star. Mm -hmm. So John's, John's repping star and money. Chris is repping money and star. You know, we're, we're, we got a little rotation going right now. Is that uncommon to have all those guys training in different spots? Yes. It's a great problem to have. <laughs> it's a great problem to have. Because mm -hmm. you're able to dual train kids. And when you can dual train kids or players, your depth grows. Does that help with those the nuanced learning stuff you're talking oh, about? Oh, no doubt. Yeah, absolutely. Because now you're learning what, yeah, absolutely. You learn what other positions are doing. What have you seen out of Byron so far? Byron's had a good camp. He's had a good camp. He's been solid, very solid. But he's got a great guy to watch with his brother in front of him. He showed improved quickness still? Like he has, yeah, 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 yeah. Got him, Chris, Shane, all those guys have, man. They've changed their bodies. Ken did a great job with them this summer. How comfortable do you feel in the system now? Yeah, it's a great question. Pretty comfortable. <laughs> Pretty comfortable. Just like those guys. Pretty, that's a great question. Uh, I'm like those guys, you know. Feel a lot more comfortable.